Tired of putting your foot down and getting nowhere? Well, hold on, because today we're gonna show you how to improve the throttle response in your truck. The Amped 2.0 Throttle Booster is what you've been looking for to gain full control over your vehicle's throttle response. All this control comes in the palm of your hand with the wireless Bluetooth switch and AMP 2.0 app for your smartphone. The throttle booster comes preloaded with five throttle curves, but gives you the ability to create thousands of custom curves based on your needs. We'll get started by disconnecting the negative terminal on the battery. Next, we'll head into the driver's footwell and locate the accelerator pedal position sensor. Disconnect the stock harness and reconnect with the harness provided with the amp throttle booster between the sensor connector and the stock vehicle harness. Connect the other ends of the harness to the amp device. Reconnect the battery and turn the ignition to the run position. The status light on the device won't light up until it's been connected with the wireless switch or smartphone. Now that we have the harness installed, let's get the app downloaded and the throttle booster put in place. Using the QR code in the instruction manual, we'll open the camera app and scan. Tap the link provided in the dropdown where you'll be redirected to the app download page in your app store. Before going further, make sure Bluetooth and location services are turned on. From here, you can follow the in-app instructions to connect to your AMP device. If you have any trouble finding your device, refresh the page by swiping down. You should only have to connect to this device on initial installation. The device is connected when the light on the AMP throttle booster is red. Once you're all set up, secure the throttle booster under the dash using included zip ties. Be sure to mount the device out of the way of the pedal, but also in a location that the status light can be seen. Be sure to register your device so you get all the necessary updates so you're not missing a thing. Now, we'll get our wireless switch to learn the pedal function. Clear the area around the pedal to make sure nothing will cause the pedal to get hung up. Press and hold both buttons on the switch panel until all the bars are lit up green. The bars will stay lit for eight seconds, then begin to scroll. When this happens, the switch is ready to learn. As the bars continue to scroll, press and release the accelerator completely to the floor. Repeat this a few times until the status light on the amp module turns green. Green means go, and once the light shows green, the pedal relearn has been successful. Didn't get a green light? Repeat the process until you do. To have the app learn the pedal function, open the amped app and select the devices section. Again, make sure the area around the pedal is clear and you have full pedal travel. In the app, select Pedal Relearn and follow the instructions. The light on the AMP device will turn orange once the app has been paired and the relearn has been completed successfully. No orange light? Repeat the process until you have the orange status light ensuring the device is connected to the app. The wireless switch and mobile app cannot be used simultaneously. If you do try to use them at the same time, the wireless switch will always override the app. Now we can dive a little more into what performance presets come with the throttle response booster and how to set up the one that's right for your truck. When changing the performance level with the wireless switch, press either arrow button on the panel until the desired level is selected. Using the app on your smartphone, select the performance tab. From here, you can toggle the buttons on the virtual switch or select the performance level off the list. Keep in mind, only the first five levels are programmed from the factory. Using the app, you do have the ability to create three custom performance options for your truck. These custom curves can only be created and saved using your smartphone. In the Levels section of the app, find the custom option and select Mod. From here, you can adjust your levels as you see fit. There are 10 data points that can be customized for each curve. These can be adjusted by simply sliding them up and down with your finger to increase or decrease sensitivity. For finer tuning, the plus and minus tabs at the top of the screen can also be used. Once you're happy with your levels, save them to the custom level section in the app. Now that we've got the amp throttle booster installed, let's see what this power stroke can do. All right, so now that we've got our power stroke out on the road, we're gonna see what these presets can really do. We've got the amped app open and you can see we got economy, stock, drive, sport, and extreme modes. Right now we're cruising along in economy mode. What can we do, Mike, to, uh, to get going here a little bit? Well, in economy, we're obviously in the lower settings, a little less aggressive and just easy driving. Now, if you want to go to extreme, we can feel a big power jump in between that. See what, it, see what it does. Oh, wow. See, I didn't even move throttle position and it was able to pick up 
quite fast. That's unbelievable how from one end of the spectrum to the other, yes. you gain quite a bit of uh, immediate throttle boost and, and some more power Absolutely. there right away. Yeah. So the stock drive and sport modes are your in-betweens. All of these maps are moddable, and then you have your custom ones down here, uh, numbers six, seven, and eight, that you can go through and adjust on your own. That and will save them right there too. Yeah, and, and you adjust them, save them, all on the fly, all right through the Amped app, and uh, you can use them for whatever, you know, whatever use you see fit for your truck. Boost your power. Get a throttle booster for your truck at xdp.com or contact your local dealer.